This sexy woman is actually a robot. Jake just bought her to be his wife. At night, the robot Anna will provide all kinds of services for Jake. After getting the command from his master, Anna will start to serve in front of his master. The cost of such a service is only one unit of electricity. Just as Anna returned to the living room to recharge her batteries, she suddenly saw a figure watching her from the window. But now she is not capable of independent thinking yet. So after the shadow disappeared, she started charging herself. Of course, except for her master's needs at night. She can fulfill her master's needs at any other time of the day. In order to make her master happy, she needs to learn how to dress up. Even if something goes wrong, she can start a repair program. These bionics are actually human bodies. Ever since the technology was first introduced, there have been many protests against its use. So, there are often extreme groups of people who use extreme methods to protest. Jake's job is to deal with these extreme people. On this day, Jake rescued a few more bionics. Meanwhile, Anna met a program administrator during the charging process. In communicating with the administrator, she learns to enhance her relationship with her host by simulating the program. So she followed the programmer into a ball that the master had thrown for her. At the ball, she met a masked man. The masked man just gave her a card and disappeared. When the ball was over and Anna saw the administrator again, her memory seemed to be in bits and pieces. But the administrator told her that there was no code for the masked man in the mop ball. But the administrator said that she could also set up her own simulation scenarios. The first program Anna set up was to knit a sweater for her master. Strangely enough, the pattern on the sweater was the same as the card given by the masked man. After coming out of the simulation, Anna went out for a ride to see the scenery. Suddenly, she was scared by a strange woman and fell down. This woman approached Anna and said, Beware of your master Jake, I'll get your memory back. This sexy woman was a bionic human being. Her master's physical needs at night and her nutritious breakfast in the morning were just part of the program for her. But this sexy robot is suddenly confused about a few things. After she meets a mysterious woman, she goes home and tells her master about what happened during the day. Her owner is flustered, but calmly tells her that it's just ordinary humans being jealous of the bionic and that she shouldn't worry about it. Then Anna gets up and starts getting ready to go to the shower. I recommend watching the original movie for this great clip. After the bath, Anna gives her master the sweater she made. Then Anna suddenly asks about her past. Jake said they met in a park. After listening to her owner's story, Anna gave her owner another loving kiss. When charging at night, Anna found the master secretly preparing to go out and he threw the sweater Anna gave him into the garbage bin. The next day, while Anna was doing her chores, that creepy woman appeared again. She smoked a cigarette in front of her as if no one was watching. Anna was on guard against her, because her master had told her that humans were jealous of them. At night, when the master came home, Anna mentioned the woman again. This time, Jake was obviously more nervous than the first time, so he rushed to find his colleague, forced Anna to sleep, and connected Anna's program to the internet. The dormant Anna was found by the masked man again, but Jake also found the location of the masked man through the network. But in the end, he realized that he had been deceived. An angry Jake went home and told Anna that her last owner was so brutal that he almost destroyed her. He was the one who saved Anna. At that moment, a colleague from the company contacted Jake and said that he could directly connect their consciousnesses to kill the masked man in the consciousness space. After a lot of preparations, Jake finally found the masked man in Anna's consciousness. When rivals meet, it's only natural that they will fight each other. They fought very hard. Anna was worried and scared just when Anna's consciousness space was shifting. Through the strange man's face, she remembered some fragmented memories again. With these memories, she suddenly and forcibly lifted her consciousness space. After waking up, Anna began to doubt everything around her. Jake looks at Anna, who is slowly losing trust in him, and decides to send her to have her memories erased. This sexy and pathetic woman is about to have her memory erased by her master. After arriving at her destination, she actually sees that there are many other beautiful robots just like her. They were all about to have their memories wiped because they had developed self-awareness. At that moment, a woman in the crowd approached her and greeted her and told Anna how to back up her memories. Anna then followed the woman's instructions and made a backup of her memories in her own consciousness space. After the memory wipe, Anna once again returned to her master Jake's home. Jake was excitedly looking forward to that obedient maid returning to his side. Just when he wanted to activate the special service again, a policeman suddenly broke into his house. He wanted to arrest Jake for murder. It turns out that the policeman's wife has received a document from the mysterious woman. Jake was afraid that the cop would tell the truth and killed him instantly. But Anna saw it all, and she finally remembered his past. It turns out that the masked man is Anna's real lover. They were just a couple of ordinary insurance salesmen. After a chance meeting, Jake couldn't get Anna out of his mind. Jake then used his law enforcement power to forcefully search them, and he mercilessly killed her lover. Then he took Anna home. After Anna resisted over and over again, 
He brutally killed her with a pillow. The pattern on the pillow was the pattern on the sweater Anna gave her. In the end, he sent Anna to his company to be transformed into an obedient robot. With her memory intact, Anna's anger level skyrocketed. She subdued Jake on the ground in one go. At this moment, she is so cold and beautiful. The man in front of her killed her lover and took away her body. In the end, she used the same pillow to end the life of the man in front of her. Then she gathered other beautiful robots with self-consciousness through the internet. She wants to lead them back to their own memories and lives.